Welcome back. Today I got five Sword and Shield base set booster packs to open. I'm looking for the full art trainer cards and specifically the full art Marnie card. So let's go ahead and open these packs and see if we could get some good hits. So I haven't opened up a lot of Sword and Shield base set. Uh, I am familiar with some of the cards in this set, but this is the first time I actually I'm opening uh, a good amount of the Sword and Shield uh, base set booster pack, so we'll see what we have in this set. Uh, there's some really new cards in here. Of course, this is the base set, so this is the new, I guess, uh, the new generation of Pokemon in the Pokemon. I guess franchise so there's a lot of new Pokemon in here from the newest game Sword and Shield so we got a rare candy a Hoot Hoot there are some older Pokemon as you could see the Vulpix Nicket but a majority I think there's a lot of new Pokemon in here and in the back we got a Hollow Oranguru not bad and I think this is the set where you have the um, the starters for the newest Sword and Shield Pokemon generation as well. So maybe we could find some of those in here. Uh, specifically, I'm actually looking for the Full Art Marnie card. Sweet, we got a couple of cards we could use for the game. Galear and Zigzagoon. Poke gear, and then in the back we got a hollow sandaconda so we're hitting technically i normally don't count hollows as a hit but technically yes they are a hit um i think the full art marnie card is definitely the most expensive card in the base set i don't remember how much it's going for but i think that's the one everybody's really chasing ordinary rod clobopus very interesting artwork as well and in the back we have a whimsicott so that is our third pack and we did not get a hit so we are on our fourth pack so let's see if we could get uh an actual hit in my opinion two three four see if we could get a v card or a full art trainer hitmonchan great ball galer and Le Le lenome silicobra machino vulpix muna rosalia blipbug whoa there we go and this is i believe a is it a full art zycan v I don't, I don't know, um, I don't really know the difference between the regular Zycan V and the full art. I think this is a full art. Wow, there we go. What a great pull. And of course, this is a great card for the game as well. A very popular, very, very strong card to use in the trading card game. So we are on our last pack. Let's see if we could get some last pack magic going. Energy Surge, Quick Ball, Galvantula, Scorbunny. That is the fire starter in this generation. Silicobra, Yamper, Grookey. This is the grass starter in this new generation. Kufin, Reverse Hollow Cinderace. This is the final of all form of um, score bunny and reboot this is the actual pokemon that i chose when i started to play the sword and shield game i think it's the best out of all three of them so and in, in the back we got a mudstale so we did not get a last pack magic hit but we we're able to hit on the zycan v it has a great ability um as you can see it's brave blade does plenty of damage and this is one of the more popular cards 
in the Pokemon game. So it's real nice that we were able to get a hit on this. So hopefully I could open more of uh, the base set so I could see more of these cards and get some of the cards that I don't really have in my collection or also find cards that would be very useful for the trading card game. So if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and like and subscribe to my YouTube channel and click that bell to be notified for whenever I upload a new video. So thank you for watching and I hope you guys have a great day.